Okay, let's look at some questions uh, related to uh, the basic budgeting process. And if we look at our first question here, looks like it says, the budgeting process does not involve which of the following activities? All right, let's take a look at these. It says, A, specific goals are established. Well, that's one of our three E's of the overall budgeting process. This is part of our planning process more specifically. And so that would, uh, because they're asking for not a part or not involved in the budgeting process, this would be an incorrect answer. <clears throat> Uh, choice B, it says uh, periodic uh, comparison of actual results to goals. Well, this word comparison here is a part of evaluation, and evaluation is part of the control process. So this is most definitely a part of the budgeting process. Therefore, again, they're asking for not so that is an incorrect answer. Execution of plans to achieve goals, one of our three E's related to the process of directing. So that is also an incorrect answer. That means that D must be correct. Let's double check. Increase in sales by increasing marketing efforts is not a part of the basic uh, budgeting process okay that is a part of that's a, that is a part of business strategy it is not a part of the basic budgeting process <clears throat> all right let's look at the second one it says budgeting supports the planning process by encouraging all of the following activities uh, another one of these except type questions now let's see here planning uh, requiring all organizational units to establish their goals for the upcoming period. Well, establishing goals <clears throat> is definitely a part of planning. They're asking for accept, so this is an incorrect answer because that is definitely a part, choice A is definitely a part of the planning process. Let's look at B, increasing motivation of managers by providing agreed upon expectations all right um, expectations are definitely part of the planning process okay I plan for you to uh, make 8,000 units of production it is my expectation that you will make 8,000 units of production therefore choice B is definitely part of the planning process and as such is wrong. All right, uh, let's see here. Directing and coordinate, coordinating uh, operations during the period. Well, our key word is right here, directing. So we have a planning process, we have a directing process. This choice C uh, appears to be the correct answer in that it is not a part of planning process. Let's look at D just to make sure. Improving overall decision making by considering all viewpoints, options, and cost reduction possibilities. This is absolutely a part of the planning process. Okay, because we're what we're doing here is we're doing all of these things uh, to help establish goals, uh, which is one of our three E's. So this would not be the correct answer, but choice C would be a correct answer. Okay, uh, let's do at least one more in this video. It says, match each phrase uh, that follows with the term A through E it describes. Okay, so it looks like we have our terms right here. Uh, and then we have our terms um, up above that. So it says, actions to achieve budgeted goals. I want you to focus on this word right here, actions, and then I want you to think about it. Well, it's not going to be 
A because this part comes after A. Okay, controlling is an evaluation process and then these other two don't make a lot of sense. Our answer choice here that is correct is directing. Directing is action oriented just like it sounds. That says oriented by the way. So the first one is going to be B. Setting goals or establishing goals is going to be a part of what do you think? A, B, C, D, or E. Establishing goals is the first of the three E's and it is associated with the planning process. So that's going to be choice A. Occurs when budgets are too loose. Well, just like a belt, the word slack, when we have budgetary slack, we can say that our budgets have been set up to be too loose or too easy to meet. So that is going to be choice D. Looks like we have spelled the word bad, and that's not good, no pun intended. All right, uh, occurs when employee self-interests are different from company goals. Uh, I believe in the presentation we called this self-conflict. We can look up here and we can probably assume that uh, goal conflict is essentially is part of the controlling process. So there we have it, B, D, E, and C. We'll pick up with the rest of these in another video.